If you're serious about cryptocurrency, the chances are you're going to need to interact with different networks on different protocols. And unless you want to on-ramp fiat to each one of these different networks or chains, you're going to need to know how to bridge your tokens from one chain to the other. However, keeping up with what chains are active, what's a scam, what's not a scam, how to do everything is going to be a little bit of a pain. And if you guys want, I'm going to show you in today's video one, one simple and easy way where you don't have to keep up with all of this. You can just go in one place and be able to bridge your tokens from Binance Smart Chain to Ethereum or from Ethereum back to Binance Smart Chain or any other network available out there that is compatible for bridging on the MetaMask wallet. Um, one simple, easy way, one place to go. It's going gonna, it's gonna to make your bridging needs an easy solution. So let's go ahead and get started. My name's Kyler and you're watching BitRush Crypto. You guys know the deal. Sub to the channel, bell on to be notified. Join up my Discord chat for extra access will be linked below. If you guys are enjoying the video, tap on that thumbs up button. And if you want to learn more about blockchain technology, I recently launched a course. You can find a link for that in the description below. And without further ado, let's get into the bridge. Okay, so for today's video, I'm going to assume you're using MetaMask. MetaMask is one of the most popular um, you know, Web3 wallets. Essentially, it is a web-based cryptocurrency wallet. They interact with most ERC compatible chains and networks. And so if you guys are using cryptocurrency for the most part, this is what you're going to need to bridge between is these ERC tokens. And I'm going to just show you guys an easy way where you don't have to keep track of what's a scam, what's not a scam, what bridges are active, what bridges aren't active. How you can do it is actually through the MetaMask app. So as you can see here on screen, we do have within our app, and this is just like a browser-based version. If you guys click here on your little MetaMask thing, um, we can see that it has the same thing here on the actual MetaMask area. Um, so all of these are right here and you can obviously switch networks for any of the ones you've currently already added. Um, I'm going to be just switching that back real quick. So we're back to Ethereum mainnet and this is just a browser based version. So same thing. Um, but here you go. Um, so we have buy and sell, we have send, we have swap, we have portfolio, and then right here in the middle, we have bridge. So if we open this up, it's going to bring us to the MetaMask bridge app. Embark on a journey of knowledge with our crypto mastery course. You'll gain insights from eight comprehensive lessons, delve into the intricities of blockchain technology, and receive personalized guidance through a one-on-one -on -one consultation. As a bonus, you'll gain access to a wealth of additional resources. Limited spaces are available, so secure your spot today by using the link in the description below. And so this is going to be a really easy, simple way that you guys can bridge and you don't have to keep track of all these bridges, what works, what doesn't work. You can swap different tokens to different bridges. It doesn't have to be the same one. Um, MetaMask is going to do all the heavy lifting for you, so they're going to keep track of what's a scam, what's not. You don't have to worry about any of that. So we just come here, we choose our network, we can choose our second network. As I mentioned, we have BNB, we have Linne, we have Polygon, Arbitrum, Avalanche, Optimism, Base, ZK Sync, Era, and obviously we're on Ethereum right here. So those are going to be the main chains. Um, if you guys need something else, you may need like a different specialized bridge, and then in that case, you would need to research what the best one is. But for the most part, for most of you guys, what you're looking to do here is probably uh, Binance Smart Chain, probably a Polygon, probably one of the layer twos here, like an Optimism. And so this will get the job done for you. And if you need to go the other way, like say we want to go Optimism to Ethereum, we just hit the swap and we're back and forth here. And now we can pick the token. So you can actually go for many different tokens. Um, again, let's go back to like Binance Smart Chain here because I think that's one of the more popular ones. But let's just say we wanted like USDT. Let's type it in. So we have USDT. So we have Tether. And let's say we wanted to bridge here onto Ethereum to like USDC. So we could actually bridge from Binance Smart Chain US D Tether to USD Circle on Ethereum. It's that easy, guys. You just type in the amount of tokens you're looking to bridge. So like one. And obviously, I don't have anything in my wallet, but it's saying, you know, you have to have a minimum of $10. So let's do like $50 here. 
Um, but yeah, you're going to need gas in your wallet on whatever network you're swapping from. And sometimes you need it on whichever one you're going to. So, you know, make sure you have a little bit of like, um, you know, extra coinage in your wallet. You may need to do like a little on ramp or ask a friend for a little bit. I know I've had to do that in the past to just basically be like, you know, can you send me like $1 worth of crypto until I swap over? And after that, I'll give it right back to you. Um, but anyway, here you go. Um, we picked these coins right here. We have Binance Smart Chain. We have Ethereum. We have $50. And it's going to take a little bit like, you know, a tenth on, you know, probably slippage or whatever. Possibly a little bit of a fee. And we can see right here, the best price is going to be on Stargate Bridge. We can choose between three different ones. We have Stargate, we have Seller, we have Connects. Um, you guys can choose best price or fastest or just mainly choose which one you want. It does have the time, the gas fee, and the return, what you're going to be end up getting. And so there you go. That's all you guys have to do. And then once you have it, obviously you need to connect your wallet and you would need to pay those gas fees. But that's it, guys. Real simple, easy way you guys can bridge your tokens from one chain to another without having to track down what the best bridge is for what network, what ones are currently active, what ones are a scam. Um, there has been some recent like bridges that have gone down and been taken over as scams now. So you know, make sure you guys are keeping your cryptocurrency safe. This is what I would recommend is just using the MetaMask wallet in app uh, bridge here. And it also has this nice feature where you can bridge from anything to anything, which is, I think, an extra bonus. Like most bridges, if you're bridging USDT, it has to go to USDT, uh, so you'd have to bridge the same token over. So this actually gives you the ability to like essentially do cross-chain swaps. Um, and yeah, that's pretty much it, guys. If you do have any questions, again, join up my Discord chat. I'm happy to help you guys with any of this stuff. Um, you know, usually I answer within like a couple of hours at the very most. I'm usually checking it multiple times a day. So if I see you're in there, I'll go ahead and answer any questions you guys may have. Obviously, I'm not tech support. So if you have a technical issue, you need to reach out to whoever it is. Like, you know, if it's with MetaMask, you need to reach out to MetaMask. Um, but if it's just something basic, I can definitely help you guys. If you do enjoy my content, though, do tap on that thumbs up button. Make sure you guys are sub to my channel as I do try to provide educational cryptocurrency content videos at least once a week. And if you guys want to learn more about blockchain technology, again, we do have that crypto mastery course that I recently launched that will be linked in the description below as well. Go ahead and claim that special discount as the price will be going up very, very soon. I'll probably always keep a little extra discount for all my viewers here. But again, if you guys want to get in cheap right now is your best time to do it.